Ulstein Group are providing ship design, ship building and equipment including power and control for the ship industry worldwide. We see more and more automation on board the vessels. So there's a lot of more devices on board. We want to develop a control system where you collect all this data and you then seamlessly could use this data in order to make more efficient ships. This system faded away both the PLC and scale -up platform. So all the user interfaces, things that the scale -up package will not do for us, we have the full freedom and we wanted to have it. We call it Ulsta Next Connect. Qt is a major part of that. There will be autonomous ships. You have to facilitate good communication between the ship and shore. And that is the thing we're working really hard on now. You will have uh, Internet of Things sensors coming in and you see that you've got not one sensor, but you've got 10, you've got 100 sensors. And you find that you add up those 4,000 I.O. you have today, that will increase 40,000, 400,000, millions. How are they going to integrate? How are you going to present all that kind of information? And that has been one of the big uh, issues uh, when we did this uh, job and we fixed it. Scalability will be the main issue a lot of people will struggle in the future. Technical depth is the kind of problems a lot of uh, vendors have out there because you have to send out the system uh, and it's going to last for 20, 30 years. And with Qt we can overcome the technical depth uh, issue in years to come. You buy something and you think, okay, this, this is going to work for me now, but what in five years? What in ten, ten years? Qt has that feasibility. We, we program in C++. We will find C++ programmers a lot of places. So we have parameterized the whole system, which makes us much more safe in terms of version control. You have one software with a lot of configurations.